Hi guys, on today's video we are back in Punta Cana and this time we brought my sister and brother-in-law. This is their first time here in Punta Cana when one of them is the first time here in Dominican Republic, period. But well, my sister-in-law had been here before for her first time in Punta Cana. So we brought them over here to introduce them to Punta Cana. And the first stop that we did today it is in Macau Beach. You know how much I love the fish in Macau Beach. So that is our first stop. So follow us. We are here in this beautiful Macau beach. I love this beach. It, it, it is nice. You can see the view. Look at how beautiful it is. Last time we came, it was a whole bunch of seaweed and it wasn't as pretty, but right now it's very nice. And it's something that I noticed is we are in May now and it's not that much, that much people. It's not that many people here in Punta Cana this time. We was around the city yesterday. You wouldn't see like in the story, in a touristic Three, trying to eat something in a restaurant. It was not that many people. This kind of was kind of empty. And now that we're here at the beach, today's Saturday, and it's also the same. It's more, you see more, even though this is a local uh, beach, but it's still, for that you see a whole bunch of uh, tourists, but this is not the case at the moment. You see a few of them, but it's not that many people here. So I guess that it is May, it is a small, a, a slow uh, month here in Punta Cana. Or well, at least this time. But we're gonna enjoy the beach to ourselves today because it is beautiful. And now we just ordered our fish. You know something that I didn't know? I thought, for me, I thought they, I always when I go to the beach, I thought the chillo was the same, similar to red snapper. But so, today I learned something, something new. Chillo is not red snapper. Chillo is something that I have to check again the menu, but chillo is different than red snapper. They are very similar, but we call red snapper something different here. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you the name before I go to this. Um, but right now we're gonna have a walk to the beach, and also we're gonna show you some more, some other things during our stay here in Punta Cana because we are introducing Punta Cana to my sister and brother-in-law. international event that I haven't even tried before. It was this Chinola Presidente. Super good. I drunk it so fast because it tastes so good. <laughs> but what is Vista Cana? Vista Cana is a new project that they are developing here in um, Punta Cana that it has so many different um, I would say it's a project, but I was about to say they have different projects inside. It's like you have different community inside the Vista Cana project. You have houses, villa type houses, you have a condo, you have apartment, you have suites. I think you go have hotels, 
it's gonna have lake and it's gonna have an artificial beach that we are sitting right in front of it. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you something. I kind of like more the artificial beach than the regular beach that we was earlier. This is the wave, it don't have too much wave, it's clean, and it's it just, it's nice. So going back to the project, we was riding around the Vista Cana project. It has so many different, um, has so many different type of uh, properties that you can choose from that is look amazing. And they, a lot of them are almost, I mean, completely done because you can see people that are already living in here. Some of them, they are working on it. Some of them are half of it. Some of them, they haven't even started on it. So if you are here about this Vista Cana project, it is amazing and they still have a lot of units that people can get into. I don't have any information in particular. I haven't get in touch with anybody. I just heard about it from some of the people. If we here today, we decided to visit it, but it's gonna be an amazing project. And I saw that they had units as low as 87 or 90,000 US for what? For a, a studio or one bedroom unit. So if you would like to be part of this project, you should, you should get information about it. Oh, if I get some information, I'll put it out in this video below. So right now we are in Bavar Beach. We just going all the way around today because they are here to vacation, but also they looking into place. They're looking for property, so we're trying to show the city different ways to go to the closer beaches depending on what they are or what property they get and that's why we came to visit um, pretty much the beach if you are staying in the city which is Bavaro Beach and this is one of the things that I was saying now that I visited this Takana I visited this Takana that I like more the main 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 beach the fake beach or artificial beach however you want to call it but it's because you don't have all the I know this is seaweed and they, you, you can do nothing about it but you don't have none of this I mean you just have a something similar to a beach you just join your time there but at the same time you can go wrong with what is real what is real is real so i like both <laughs> so right now we're gonna walk around here to Barbara beach and enjoy the beach for a little bit and then we will move on after a long hard day of work today very hard work now we have time to relax and we are right here enjoying this pool in this beautiful evening and here in one of the properties that we manage it, that we manage this is a apartment one of our Airbnb apartment here in the Cana Rock condos in the, in the Hard Rock properties and I don't know if you have shown one of these uh, this property in my videos before I can remember right now but I just wanted to show you tonight in the case that i haven't and this community is very quiet that's what most that i love about it is they when you come over here you is you, you have some quiet quality time like when you come to the pool you don't see that many people never i think the first time that we have had this airbnb if we have come that we don't come very often but when we come we don't see that many people i think this is the first time that i see so many people and is that group over there that group over here we're right here in the middle but this is a nice community in the hard rock property and as you can see right behind me they have a a golf court that you can use if you come they have like golf cart that you can rent it out if you come you can also use the the pool the, the beach club of the hard rock but for that you have to pay like 25 dollars per person if you can consume those 25 dollars if you come to one of these property you can drink or eat it's just yeah if you go over that amount then you have to pay the extra <laughs> did you have to explain that but this is a nice quiet community and it's very close like if you go to the macau beach uh it is about 15 minutes from here and then if you go to the, the, the town area where you can find like supermarkets, restaurant banks, that is Fuisa uh, area, then it's about 10 minutes from here. And also they have like comados very close that you can call if they do delivery. 
So, in the end of this video, I'm going to put the link of the two Airbnb that we have in this property. We have the penthouse that is in the third floor. They have um, a private um, a private deck and it have the own, uh, we have a jacuzzi and it have a covered area that is very nice at night. And we also have one of the first floors. This one is the one that we are used to today that is right in front of the, uh, the pool. So it is right... In, uh, well no that one right there in the front but the other one on the right i'm gonna but i'm gonna show it to you a little later it is kind of dirty because we got here yesterday and he, you have some you know when you come to the apartment it's not look as nice when you first come in but i'm gonna show it to you anyway so today has been even though i was joking with a hard working day you know we work but we also enjoy our every time that we work and we enjoy our time and that is the beauty of doing this kind of work. But uh, we, it was a very productive day. Uh, we started going to the Macau Beach, which we love Macau Beach. They always, with the fish, they always on point. And uh, then we went to visit the Vista Cana uh, project, which is an amazing project. We went to visit it. I have heard about it for some of the people that want to invest in it. And I look, I search the price and the property, how it's gonna be. I thought it was amazing. But today when we visited, I like it even more and also my uh, brother and sister-in-law they love the property so let's see what happens with that and then also of course we want to visit our project yep. but we, we gave you an update of that uh, about two weeks ago but they even are more advanced in the project so I like oh yes but I forgot to tell you yeah I'm gonna show pictures now he the developer of Prados Verde, he opened another side that he's gonna be selling some new plaques. And the price of the plaques will be 3,500 pesos for a square meter and 4,000, depending on the, like if you have corners, that would be 4,000 for a square meter. And it's in the middle, 3,500 pesos for a square meter. But that project is also developing very well. I took some pictures and some, the houses that he already built. And also we have the opportunity to go inside the house, like the motor house, it looks really nice. And he had built already about 40 houses. And that project to be the one that he's doing. He's supposed to be delivered by December. So, yes, it was a productive day. Right now, we are here enjoying this pool. The water is, it feels really good because today, I don't know, for some reason, lately had been very, very extremely hot. And in Punta Cana, I don't know why, I feel like the sun is even hotter here in Punta Cana than Santo Domingo. But, beautiful day everything good but right now we are going to enjoy the pool with my beautiful princess leia and my i would say beautiful husband because he's a beautiful handsome and my handsome husband and we're gonna enjoy this pool tonight so guys after a long day hard work it ain't even all let me let me so after a hard day, no, no, so after a day, so after a long, long day, it's a beautiful, um, this is a nice, uh, this is a nice, what, the nice community? Nice community. Mm. So after a long day of hard work, we deserve some relaxed time. <laughs> very hard day of work <laughs> but we are right here enjoying this beautiful pool oh we are no let me tell you stop the beautiful no one to say beautiful anymore. 